Umpire gives the go ahead. Skeen's ready to roll. He winds and delivers. First pitch, fastball misses high and outside. We are underway. Two and two, the count down to Rodriguez. Here's the swing and a miss. Down on strikes goes Rodriguez. The Skeens blows that one by him. Here's the 3 1 to Gavin. In on the hands for ball four. Talk now or no. Here's the 0 1. It's going to hit Morgan in the back shoulder. Runners first and second. The 1 2. Called oh. strike three on the outside corner. Have him as the DH. The 1 0. Big swing. Ground ball towards the shortstop. He picked up, throw to second, a little delay on the throw to first, and it gets away from Klein, and that's going to allow Dugas to come in to score. So they get Morgan at second, and there was just some hesitation by Stanton. 2 2 pitch. Hit high in the air, shallow right field. Staten, the second baseman, going back, and he will have it. But Skeen's working quickly. Here's the 2 2 called strike three. And boy, did Steele know it. It's like Randy Johnson used to be. He was pretty good. See ya. Called strike three. The one two pitch right on the inner black. With one down, the three one to Jones. And that one is ripped to left field. Steele going back, and this one is off the wall. Jones will play it off the top of the wall. One out, runner at second, the three one. And there's ball four. Kling, wide stance at the plate. Cravey fires. Chopper towards short. Going to be a tough play. How coming in. Gloves it. Throws on the run. Not in time. Kling beats it out. Everybody's safe. First, second, and third. How about a hustle from Paxton Kling? The pitch to Dugas. Mm. Cold strike three. At the knees. Inner half. Gavin a little surprised. The 1 1 to Morgan. Popped up in the air, foul territory, third base side. Coming over is Anderson near the dugout and oh. hits his glove. He can't hold on. Time at the railing. One two to Morgan. Ah. And a swing and a miss. Foul tip, but held on to by Dreyer, and the Tigers squander a bases loaded opportunity. One one. There's a line drive shot, a little hopper, right at second base. Off the glove of the backhand try by Dugas. Couldn't field it. Caroms off of his glove, fielded by Thompson from the right side. The 0 2 pitch and a swing and a miss. Nowhere close on the third try. Runner goes, the 2 1 opposite field, little bloop single, and then the bounce into right field, and around second into third comes Staten. And that time, Dreyer just got the bat on the ball. Nobody at home at second with the runner right side of the infield. Insult. Oh, here's a wild pitch. It gets beyond Neal, and coming in to score will be Staten, and the Bulldogs have tied the game now, 1-1. Now the 1-2 to the plate. Swing and a miss. Another strikeout for Skeens. Runner at second, the 2-2. In the air to right field. Kling going back, turning, twisting, and has it for out number three. Brown ball, and sneaks through by Hal, the shortstop. Base hit for Dylan Cruz gets the leadoff man aboard for the Tigers to start things here in the bottom of the third inning. Wide awaits the 3 0 pitch. Missing low ball four. Cravey to the plate. And it gets away from Dreyer. Take Off that. the top of his mitt. To the backstop it goes. And the Tigers advance runners second and third. Tommy White at second. Just one out in a 1 1 game. And Thompson lifts one to center field. Rodriguez. Coming over and he'll make the grab. Tagging up his Cruz. The throw to the plate. Not in time. Cruz slides in safely. It's 2-1 LSU. First pitch a called strike to Jones. The 0-1. A little soft knock. One hopper to the shortstop. How? He'll glove it. Throw to first. And the Tigers are done here in the bottom of the third. Field his first time up. 1-2. Swing and a miss. That one triple digits. 1-0-0. Skeens looks in another 0 2. Swing and a miss. Chase this one outside. Give him his seventh punch out. It's like Nintendo out there for him. And there's another swing and a miss. And there is strikeout number eight. Get you a full rundown coming up in a bit. Here's the payoff pitch. Off speed. Misses high and clean. Earns the walk. Gravy checks the runner out of the plate. Gets by Dreyer, rolls right between his legs, cling easily, trots down to second. 2 1 delivery, again in the dirt. Cling Great reads lead. it, got away from the catcher Dreyer, but a good throw down to third, and they will get it. 
No, they called him safe. Oh, they called him safe. Oh, it looked like he yeah. set out. And and that was attributed to his speed, but the read that he got on that secondary lead, he read it in the dirt all the way. He was off with the pitch. And a bullseye throw from Dreyer behind home plate. <laughs> I didn't see the left hand of the umpire, just the right. This one given a ride by Merrifield to center field, but Rodriguez coming over. He will glove it, but deep enough for Kling to tag up, coming to score in the <laughs> third run of the game. So Merrifield gets inserted into the lineup, gets the sack fly RBI. The proof's in the pudding. They're leading, leading the country and fielding the ball. 2-2, two -two, swung on, ground ball right to Thompson. It's short. Of the throw course. is in the dirt, of and course. Jones cannot dig this one out. Skeens with the runner going, swing and a miss. Throw down by Neal, and it gets away from Merrifield off the edge of his glove. Fires the 2-2. There he is. That's a called strike three. Pitch to Tommy, ground ball towards second base coming over. Shortstop, How with it, high throw, and missing the tag is the oh. first baseman, Klein. It brought him off the bag. Women's basketball. See where they get started. Here's one lifted high and deep to right field off the bat of Jones, and it was in the diamond deck. See ya. Jones opposite field. Two runs. Tigers get a little separation off the bat of the freshman. It's 5 1. And that one went 347 feet, but jumped off the bat at 107 miles an hour. It's a towering fly ball. Landed about three rows up into the Community Coffee Diamond Deck. Jared Jones, though, knew that he got it even into the wind. Nice little bat flip there down the first baseline. Field will result in. A little better result at the plate, but not this time when you're facing Paul Skeen. Nope. Swinging a miss on three pitches. Skeens delivers the payoff pitch. This is low. That's the first base on balls given up by Skeens tonight. In the top of the six. The 0 1. Oh. Gonna hit him. Ouch. Ooh. We see a Skeens. The 1 the 2. Six. Swinging a miss. Got him to chase it high. And if it is the last we see of Skeens tonight, how about 12 strikeouts? I'll take it. Pitch. Payoff pitch. Slap base hit into left field. A shot off the bat of Paxton Kling, his second hit of the evening, and the Tigers have the leadoff man aboard here to start the bottom of the sixth inning. Bunt here. Now he'll bring it back. Swing. Runner goes. The throw down to second. Paxton in with his second stolen base of the night. 2-0 pitch right up the middle ground ball base hit into right center field Kling will score Morgan with his 16th run driven into the year and the Tigers extend the lead six to one pitch to Cruz smacked opposite field base hit into right Morgan will cruise into second Cruz will cruise into first white rarely steps out of the box he's always ready to go and this one jetted to right center field Rodriguez on a run but he can't get to it takes a bounce in front of the track Coming around third is Morgan. Right behind him is Dylan Cruz. And a two-run double for Tommy White. And the Tigers now open it up. It's 8-1 LSU. As White delivers RBI 15 and 16. His sixth double of the year. Thing of beauty, Chris. Out there to right center field. Hit, a, hit the ball about as hard as you can hit a baseball. Looked like a golf ball coming off the bat. And Tommy White once again showing why he was the number one transfer in the portal. With one out the pitch. Missing ball four, so Neal earns the walk. 2-2 Two -two to Thompson. Shot to center field. Rodriguez settles under it and squeezes it for the second out. Now Tommy White trying to advance to third. The it. throw from Rodriguez gets How away over the head of the new third baseman, and that will bring Tommy in to score. That's just heads up baseball right there from Tommy White. McPaul, the pinch runner down at third with two down. The 1-1 one, one to Jones. This uh -oh. one a mile high headed towards the scoreboard in left field. And it's over the scoreboard. Over. Ball went over the scoreboard. Another two-run blast for Jared Jones. Second home run of the night. And Trackman going to have to work to figure this one out. Chris, I'm going to guess here, 110 off the bat, cleared the left side of the scoreboard. We saw one off the top of the right side of the scoreboard that was, do you remember that, 467, something like that? Yep. I'm going to guess that ball was 
470, 465 plus. Over the left corner of the scoreboard in left field. Maybe 475. I mean, holy guacamole. Sixth inning highlighted by Jared Jones. Fourth home run of the year, second of the night. Here's a comebacker to Riley Cooper who checks into the game and maybe got a piece of him, maybe yeah. a piece of the glove, and then an UNO on Tuesday at 6 30. Oh, come on. This one misses for ball four. So runners first and second. Another pinch hitter in the first pitch. Shallow fly ball to center field. Coming in. Paxton clean. Sliding on a knee. Makes the play for out number three. And the Tigers get the win. Another 10 run rule in effect. Thank you.